there and welcome to Neofight.tv, the technology show for the not-so-geeky. My name's Tiffany Young. And I'm Ben Friedman, and we are back today out at beautiful Saguaro Lake. Is it a gorgeous day? Another hard day at work at the oh, office. I tell you, it's, okay. uh, it's a beautiful, beautiful day. And the reason gorgeous. we're out here today is because uh, it, it, this actually all started a year ago at CES back in January. Do you remember that? I do, I We do. went to CES, and we were looking at all the high-tech places, and one of the booths was Airhead. Airhead, which made as boating people know, tubes. And somebody made a beeline for uh, the Airhead gadget stuff, the right. boards, the and tubes, well, the ropes. You know, we're thinking Airhead, why is, why anyway, is Airhead so. technology? And yet they are a very high-tech tech company. Yeah. So what Airhead has done, and they sent us a really nice sampling of some of their stuff we're going to look at today. What Airhead has done is they've taken the latest in tubing technology and wakeboarding technology, and they've really brought the price down. Now, this is stuff that you're, if you're a hardcore shaved head, you know, I'm doing 360 flip stuff in the air, this stuff will see you through, but really it's designed for people who are beginner to intermediate, uh -huh. don't want to spend $500, $800 on, I mean, that's what the real pro boards cost is right. five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars you know, for a board and bindings and, and all that sort of stuff. You can get into some of these for uh, much, much closer to like $200, you know, $250 for some of these boards. Well, yeah, and it gives you an idea of whether you really like the sport, whether you're into it or not, whether it's something you want to make a future investment in if you decide that it's the sport for you. Exactly. So Airhead sent us a great uh, supply of stuff here. Let's take a quick look before we head out on the water. Quick look at what we're going to be looking at today. First of all, this is, uh, here is the Heart Attack Wakeboard with wrap bindings. And this is great for... This is really Somebody who watches their cholesterol. Yeah, a heart attack board. Yeah, if you take a look on the back here, I don't know if you can see down here, there's a little heart with an arrow uh, through it down there. And that's the uh, design. And, you know, they all have to try to be hardcore with all of their designs. You know, they right. want to be well, hip and you cool. Right, you got to be bad. That's right. You got to be bad to board. <laughs> bad to the board? That's very bad funny. Bad to board. <laughs> yeah. So these are very, very good beginner um, uh, bindings. And it's a great board for people up to about 170 pounds. So it's a great gal board, a great board for someone like Tiffany. Someone like me. See, here's, here's the wrap. What's really nice, I don't know if, if you have boarded, you know how hard it is and difficult it can be to get your feet in the boots. Yeah. This is a nice, nice design. These, yeah, for getting these your bindings, feet in and out. they're very adjustable. So mm -hmm. for a beginner who doesn't need the ultimate in, you know, suction on a boot. And the, and the bottle of Joy dish soap. That's to right. Get your, yeah, to, to get, get your foot your in there. In. You can get this in. If it comes out in the water, it's very easy in the water to get that board back on. Right. This package here, the board and the bindings, you can have for about $200. So wow. it's a really good yeah. deal for a beginner wakeboarder really or, a, deal, or yeah. a, a gal who wants her own wakeboard. Maybe not total hardcore with these bindings, but, right. but still a pretty good deal. Right. All right, let's move on. Now, here we have, now this is my board. This is for the men. This is for, for <laughs> all for weight board. classes. And, right. and I'm, you know, 200 plus <laughs> pounds. So, you know, I, this is I a... we didn't talk about my weight. That was nice. <laughs> <laughs> Your, yours was the under 170 board. Yes, and you are that way was under 170. 170. <laughs> So I would not be able to ride the 170, under 170 board. It might be fun to try. Yeah. <laughs> Can I pull you? I'll just go submarine. <laughs> right. <laughs> like Hold that. your breath. <laughs> so this is the breakout board with vice bindings. So this is a step up on the bindings. Now you can yeah. put any bindings on any board. This package goes for about $210. It's a longer board and wider. I, and, and this will be my second time trying this board. I came out here once without you. See, now I would, I would, I would, I think I want to still try this board anyway. You could definitely try this board. Yeah, there's there's it, no reason I, not to. Yeah, I think yeah. I like the way it just, you know, it's got a little more water displacement in it its does. design. It's, this is a, if you have a, a slower boat like we do here. This is an easy board to get up on because it has a lot of displacement, a lot it of looks surface like it's area. It's going to be a little faster too. Um, yeah, I mean the long. Uh, yeah, I think it's going to be a little faster. So yeah, it's it's a nice looking board, and these up. bindings are still easy to get into, but they do cinch up mm -hmm. a little bit tighter. Uh, yeah, part right here. We're a little bit tighter than the other ones. So you may need joy, or you may not. We'll That's see. That's right. You can still loosen them up, but yeah. you they can still tighten down a little more. Now we're also going to get our kids uh, doing some tubing today. Right. And uh, tubes are what Airhead is is probably best known for. And they sent us a couple of tubes here, which we'll take a look at today. This one over here. I'll actually, pause. Before we get into tubes, I just want to say they sent us these really cool spectra rope and this is uh they call it thermal spectra rope yeah. it's very thin and if you take a look tiff you'll notice the most important thing is that it doesn't stretch so anytime you want to be wakeboarding it's much yeah, much that's... easier to do tricks and to to get across the wake right. and that kind of stuff if you have a rope that doesn't stretch stretchy ropes are much harder well is it prop proof 
<laughs> there's no such I've thing as a, a few good ropes rope, on the prop, yeah. But, uh, so I, I wouldn't so say like prop it's proper. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> that's prop, what I need. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I absolutely agree. I, I really like to wakeboard, and when you are behind a boat that has a, a good wake behind it, yeah. a non stretchy rope is a must have. Right. Once again, this we're on a pontoon boat today, so we're mm -hmm. not going to be catching a lot of air on these wakes. Right. But it's still nice to have this non stretch rope. Easier to get up on than a stretchy rope. Definitely. Uh, because it doesn't have that give where you start, you get going, and then it stretches a bit, and then it's. You know, right. you know what I'm trying to say. I, I know what you're saying. So, I don't know. Is there room for this tube? This is a nice little tube. Yeah, there we go. This is the Airhead Blast. And it's a one-person tube or, you know... I like my, their names, yeah. the Airhead Blast. Well, again, it's a cool name. Yeah. Again, very inexpensive. I mean, you have tubes going up to $300. Yeah. Uh, you can get this for about 50 bucks, And inflates wow. very easily, yes. just one, one inflation on it. Great. For, and my kids love this tube. They get it in. It's like a little, they're like in a well, big donut. Well, there's lots of handles. Right. I mean, it makes it easy to get up from anywhere, which is really nice when you're, when you're uh, out there in the water and trying to get up. Something slimy touches your feet, and you're trying to get up on, the, on your tube Eww. in a hurry. Yuck. <laughs> and then finally today, let's uh, see if I can uh, put this back towards you. Whoa. Whoa. Okay. Right. I'm going to just uh, run up here and grab this other one. Now, this is the one I like. So this is the RIP oh, 2. Oh, it's got little fins on it. Look at that. Yeah. Now, what's cool about this, so it's an open back tube. I don't know if you can see it real easily here. You'll see it in the water in a bit. This is an open back tube with an inflatable uh, surface. So you're not sitting right on the water. You're actually sitting on an inflated pad. And if you take a look, uh, just what uh, Tiffany was saying here on the back. Let me flip it over. Wah. There are. Can you see up there the fins? Yeah. Yeah. See, there's fins on the side. Now, the cool thing about the fins is when you lean, it steers in that direction. So if you turn one way, you can steer we, to the right, steer to the left. We all know the, the best left. way to lean is getting your knee right up on the side there. Yeah. With all your weight, digging in as much as you can and getting as low profile are we gonna to the see, water. Uh, are we going to see your technique on that today, uh, Tiff? I'm we hoping. are. Yeah. Yes, we are going to see some technique on that. So that is the RIP2 tube. It's about $60. <laughs> and they also send us uh, their uh, high pressure pump, 30 bucks for their new pump. See, Blows these their, things up in an instant. Their prices 30 seconds are to blow this up. phenomenal. It really is. It's their good deal. prices deals. are phenomenal, and it's really good quality for what you get. So, yeah. why spend the big bucks? You don't need to. Exactly. Unless you're a pro boarder. So, so uh, you ready to uh, get wet and hit the water? I'm ready to get wet. All right, let's go out there and we'll, uh, we'll see what it looks like.
So here I am on the tube. Say hi, Tiff. Hello. There's Tiffany. This is my wife, Jody. And we're going to go over a little tubing run here on this tube. Oh my goodness. Uh oh. oh. I don't like the sound of that. Ah. Alrighty, here we go. Alrighty. I fell off. I'm in the water. Uh, nah. That was a lot of fun. I don't know if I had the camera on me very much, but uh, it's really good. Here comes the boat. You can see it right behind me there. And uh, thanks to get to Airhead, I'm probably going to have one more try. You know they say, bad day on the lake is uh, better than a good day at the office. And I gotta tell you, this is not a bad day on the lake. So thanks to the good people at Airhead, fantastic products, we've enjoyed them. And uh, you know, keep us in mind the next time uh, you come out with something for the lake, you know, because we'll go. Oh yes, we will go. I'm Ben Friedman, Neofight.tv. I don't really know what you just said, but yeah, I don't know I, what I you said. said. I sent the presentation uh, on the spreadsheet, but next one's present. The newest iPods, including the new iPod Classic, which comes out of the new iPod Hi there, I'm Ben Friedman from Neophyte.tv. And for the best sound for your podcasts or office communications, check out the microphones at revolabs.com.